hello and welcome back to my channel in this video i'm going to be doing a review of my filtration and what i'm going to be doing about it let's get to it All right, this is my compressor right here. It's a 60 gallon compressor with a two stage pump on the top and a five horsepower motor. This is uh, the way I have it uh, set up. This is what I'm gonna be talking about, the filtration. This filtration has been installed in this compressor for the past six years and it's beginning to fail. Um, it's it's old so we got to change it and what kind of filtration am I gonna put now let me go to the my bench show you what filter filtration I'm gonna be installing real quick the filters are from HTP and they're five stage right there as you can see um, this is has been one of the best filtration systems that I have ever used so uh, I'm kind of sad as to they're not working the way it's supposed to but I'm gonna be installing some new ones let me just show you which ones they're gonna be and this is a new filtration that I'm gonna be installing yes it's exactly the same one and why am I going with the same ones because I've never ever had an issue with them until now six years later so if it ain't broke don't fix it so it is broke right now but I'm gonna be installing the same ones right there it comes with everything that you need and also it also comes with uh, some desiccant beads brand new desiccant beads so let's install it All right so let's prepare this one before uh, removing the other one uh, it does come with a gauge I did put some Teflon tape and this is gonna go right there so all you're gonna need is just screw it on there it is first step now let's do this all right you're gonna get this piece right here this is where the connection for your air holes is gonna be at so this needs to be like this and insert it right there so let me just put some Teflon on both of these and install it just like that and these are high flow fittings guys right there as you can see high flow okay now i turned it around because we need to cover this right here okay they do provide you with this uh plug so we're gonna have to put it this is if you wanted the the gauge on this side but i want it on the other side there you go it's plugged up now let's flip it over now comes the shutoff valve which is going to be going right here on the first stage let me put some teflon and install it there you go we're almost done now let's install the brackets there it is the brackets are mounted now let's remove the other one all right i've removed the old filters there they are now let's install the new ones there you go the new filtration is on i did remove this canister because we need to install the the second beads so let's go to the bench and pour it in all right here are the desiccant beads they're gonna go inside this canister and uh, install it and you'll be good there it is let's uh, install it back and we got brand new filters and here's the old one well they last about six years which is really good here's a new one ready to go I do put this at a hundred that's uh, the perfect setting that I have found out that it works perfectly so we're good to go it's been connected got some air let's get it going this is gonna be it guys this is gonna be it thank you very much for uh, viewing this video and like always hit that little note with the notification bell so you can be notified whenever I upload a video don't forget to subscribe for more content that's coming up and Stay safe, guys. I'll see you this coming uh, weekend. Like always, stay safe and God bless.